My name is Kent Risky. I'd like to talk to you today about my book, Reversing Heart Disease and Preventing Diabetes. First, I'll give a little overview about my background. I have a Bachelor of Science degree, major in Mechanical Engineering, and I've practiced as a professional mechanical engineer for my career. But uh, at the age of 44, I suddenly developed high blood pressure, hypertension. And in those days, the doctors didn't have the diagnostic tools they have today. So I went along with my high blood pressure. It went up and down and varied for like 24 years. And one day in 2007, I had a heart attack. I had plaque in my heart artery. It ruptured, formed a little clot, and I was in the hospital. Fortunately, I had a very good cardiologist, and he placed a stent in that uh, narrowing plaque area. He also observed two other places at the same time where plaque was 40% restriction and 50% restriction, but he didn't do anything with those at that time. So uh, I decided to go on a quest to find out how I could reverse my heart disease, if, if at all. I began, because I'm a science major, I began studying uh, human physiology and heart disease and all these matters on a scientific basis. And I developed my own program based on what I learned. And two years later, in 2009, the same cardiologist did an angiogram. And to his surprise, the plaque that was 40% had shrunk by 50%, and so had the other area. So I was reversing my heart disease. Well, the bottom line is, how do you do this? First, I lowered my LDL by 100 points to below 70. I raised my HDL considerable amount to a nearly 70. In addition, your triglycerides must be below 100 and significantly below if possible. Your glucose must remain below 100 24 hours a day, even after meals. And your insulin, which is a very important factor, must be down around t below 10 and preferably near 7. Now all of this is in my book. Let me show this to you. The book is very very thick. There's a lot here. There's more than 700 pages. I only have two recipes because I didn't want to fill the book with recipes. Let me show you the back cover. My publishing company is Exalt Publishing. It's on the web. Exalt, E-X-A-L-T, publishing.com where you can get more information. Uh, it's available in hardcover or paperback. And you can see from the edge here, it's quite thick. Now I will briefly go through the topics. The first chapter after my introduction is cardiovascular disease overview. Uh, a lot of people don't get much information from the doctor. They're not quite sure what's wrong with them and so on. This gives you a good overview from a scientific basis. The second chapter is Dietary Scientific Facts in Human Physiology. Well, there's a lot of misconceptions in this, uh, in this subject. Just how does the human body work? So I won't go into details now but you should find that very interesting. The third chapter is Scientific Causes for Cardiovascular Disease. 
Now, they say risk factors, they list risk factors for cardiovascular disease like not enough exercise, you're overweight, eat too much fat, eat too much red meat, blah, blah, blah. Those aren't scientific causes for heart disease. I list the scientific causes. Primarily, it can be caused by virus, bacteria, high insulin levels, high glucose levels, high triglycerides. So my goal was to attack each of those areas, which I did. Now in the next chapter, I tell you in great detail how I reduced my HDL 100 points. I have my blood test results over two years, four different results. You rarely see these kind of personal blood test data in books and, and articles. The next chapter is how to lower your blood pressure, and I won't go into that in much detail, but it goes along with the entire program or regimen. The next chapter is diet therapy for heart valves, palpitations, arrhythmias, and other heart rhythm abnormalities. So one fellow, he bought the book, he is under his doctor's care. He read it, he applied what he read in here, and in three days his palpitations were gone. So he didn't have to have laser surgery on the nerves in his heart. Uh, heart rhythm is greatly affected by minerals, so this chapter covers a lot of minerals. Next chapter is learn when exercise can kill you, and it can. So be careful on that. They tell you, oh, exercise is wonderful for you. But as we know, uh, at marathons, triathlons, they have ambulances standing by. Those ambulances are not for the people watching the race. They're for the participants. And it's surprising. I list races in which two or three people had a heart attack and a couple died. So it's not uncommon. It's just not in the news much. Uh, in the next chapter I talk about red meat because red meat really gets a bad rap. There's a lot of incorrect information about saturated fats and red meat in general. Some diet gurus say it causes cancer, it causes heart disease. That's not scientific. That's an agenda. So you want to watch out for that. The paleo diet is very popular these days. That's the caveman diet. I had to put a chapter in here because the books and a lot of publications make assumptions and list facts that are just not scientific. Then I have a chapter on breaking uh, weight loss plateaus. And the very last chapter is your road to reversing heart disease. It tells you all of the uh, uh, areas where people are diverted from the right path to reversing heart disease onto something else. So that will caution you about not taking these other paths. Here's how you can get the book. You can buy it directly from me. My name is Kent Riske, R-I-E-S-K-E. -E. The spelling is unique, so if you search on the internet, you can find it in any bookstore. My address is 5086 Cottonwood Drive, Boulder, Colorado, 80301. You send a check or money order uh, for $26 for paperback, $34 for hardcover. If you'd like to buy an international uh, order, the best way to get that is from Book Depository. They have free shipping and good prices, shipping to most countries. Thank you very much for watching this video, and have a good day.